Hey guys, welcome to my next Let's Play The Walking Dead. We're going to play Episode 1, A New Day. I got a few minutes into this, but um, I was having some video recording problems because I'm on the Mac side and I got to kind of work out the kinks on that. So um, I'm just going to be using QuickTime Pro for QuickTime Player for my audio and ScreenFlow for my video. That way I can kind of mesh them around and adjust my voice volume over the game volume because I've been having a lot of problems with that lately. So let's go to play. We'll start a new game. Of course, we'll hit play again. So it's episode one, a new day. It actually looks like a pretty cool game. I'm pretty excited about it. I'm going to try to cut the game as close to the load screen as I can. It's the only save spot in the game is when it loads. dead. Dom, dom, dom. And a familiar Atlanta skyline from the series. Oh, at least I'm not playing a white cis protagonist. It's awesome to see that they actually kind of vary a little bit. It is beautiful, though. Well, I reckon you didn't do it, then. Why do you say that? You know, I've driven a bunch of fellas down to this prison. Lord knows how many. Usually it's about now I get the, I didn't do it. Not for me. Because guys in your position already said it enough. Followed your case a little bit, you being a making boy and all. You're from making bit. Yep. Came up to Atlanta to be a city cop in the 70s. Always wanted to work a murder case. Like that senatorial mess you got yourself mixed up in. With all due respect. A real uh, senatorial. Hell, the whole family used to be regulars at your folks' drugstore right in downtown. Still there? Sure is. Good. He advised uh, medical personnel and route to Hart Field, very intense 20 coming in. I got a nephew up at UGA. You teach there long? Going on my sixth year. You meet your wife in Athens? You wanna know how I see it? Sure. Regardless, could be you just married the wrong woman. Riot in progress. All officers are available for you coming to one seven. Rolling calls and dispatches to all locations. Oh yeah, shit's coming down. I'm driving this man once. He he was the worst one. He wouldn't stop going on about how he didn't do it. He was an older fella, big soft eyes behind a pair of smart folk glasses. And he just wailing back there. Says it wasn't him. Crying and snotting all over right where you're sitting. Then before long, he starts kicking the back of the seat like, like a fussy baby on an airplane. And I tell him he's got to stop. That's government property and I'll be forced to zap him otherwise. So he stops, and having exhausted all his options, he starts crying out for his mama. Mama, it's all a big mistake. It wasn't me. So did he do it? They caught the fucker red-handed, stabbing his wife, cutting her up as the boys came through the door. He sits in my car screaming bloody murder that it wasn't him. I think he actually believed it himself. It goes to show, 
people will up and go mad when they believe their life is over. Oh, I got another good one for you. This one's a little bit less depressing and a bit more hilarious if I do so. Uh oh. This oh, other shit. time. Houston, we have a problem. I need to get out of here. We're getting out. Oh, hell yeah. Ow. Oh, and of course it's the super steep area. See, I think I like the way the background's set up. I, I think I like the art. I wasn't sure I'd like it, but... Ooh, shotgun shell. That probably means I need that. Oh, please don't be somebody that drops everything. Or falls, or whatever. The officer's shotgun is over there. Like, okay, come on over there. Why would he have needed that? Looks empty. <laughs> Not a good sign. Carry with these cuffs off. Oh, really? You're gonna make me get the cuffs off? I bet you they're on him, and I bet you this is gonna suck. He's gonna get up. I know it. Officer, just get the keys and get out of here. Oh no, it's by his mouth. Oh, I guess the other one. <clears throat> oh, he's breathing. Shit. Officer. Oh god. Holy shit! Yep, we're backing away. Back. What the hell? What the fuck are you? Dude, Get grab the me. shotgun. Grab the shotgun. Oh, oh no, not Butterfinger. Don't make me do this. Ah, crap. I am so sorry, dude. I'm really sorry. Man. I do like that the little dots are above things. Go get someone! There, there's been a shooting! Grab his gun, dude. Come on. Oh no. Oh god. Run, run! Ah. 
Oh shit. Go, go, go. Okay, so gunshots are bad, but I knew that from the TV series, so. <coughs> now, as a side note, my job's been going really well. I'm learning a lot, feeling a little under overwhelmed, but, but it's Hello? going well. Anybody? Okay, how can we do this? I kind of feel like that game in the 80s, the dragon, dragon something, I can't remember the name of it now. I'm filling one of those teacups with some bourbon if I could. No ladder. I'm not getting up there anyway, this leg the way it is. Help! Anybody up there? No, guess not. Okay. I wonder where that girl went, because I'm sure that's got to be, she's got to be around here. Let's go check out the house. Maybe they have some guns. I wonder if anybody's home. Hello? Anybody home? I need a little help. Oh god, don't shoot the black guy. That's all I gotta say. Coming in. Don't shoot, okay? Nope. Nope. Where are the buttons here? Okay. Ah! Hello? I'm not an intruder. Or one of them. Oh boy. These people might need more help than I do. Oh, there's going to be a little kid zombie. This is going to suck. Are you going to fall on everything? Really? Everything? I'm clumsy, and I'm not that clumsy. Oh, God, I don't want to check the voicemail. Take the water. Come on. Let's see if we can strip down the, the cupboards before I start anything with that voicemail. I'm assuming it's a game that I have to go through all the cupboards. Oh, bingo. Woo! Look at that. I knew that was the right thing to do. Come on, give me something else, guys. But I don't see a health bar, so maybe I don't need to worry about food. That beeping's an answer machine. I can tell that from here. But I'm going to check everything first. Mm. Marshalls. That's a Savannah area code. But that's the type of note you'd leave a babysitter. Oh, boy. Okay. Can you not fall again? That would be nice. It's fake. Damn. Who has fake fruit? Maybe there's something on there. Furniture overturned, blood everywhere. Jesus. Maybe there's oh God. something on there. Yes, yes. There we go. Three new messages. Message one. Left at 5.43 p.m. Hey, Sandra. This is Diana. We're still in Savannah. 
Uh, Ed had a little incident with some crazy guy near the hotel, so we had to get him back to the ER and have it checked out. Anyway, he's not feeling well enough to drive back tonight, so we're staying an extra day. Thanks so much for looking after Clementine, and I promise we'll be back in time before your spring break. Message two. Left at 1119. Oh, God, Dad's going to be a zombie. Oh, my God, finally. I don't know if you tried to reach us. All, all the calls are getting dropped. They're not letting us leave and aren't telling us anything about Atlanta. Please, please, just leave the city and take Clementine with you back to Murrieta. I've, I've got to get back to the hospital. Please let me know that you're safe. Message three. Left at 651 a.m. Clementine, baby. If you can hear this, call the police. That's 911. We love you. We love you. We love you. Shit. tried to get me, but I'm hiding until my parents come home. What's your name? I'm Clementine. This is my house. Hi, Clementine. I'm Lee. Where are your parents? They took a trip and left me with Sandra. They're in Savannah, I think. Where the boats are? Are you safe? I'm outside in my treehouse. They can't get in. That's smart. See? Can you see me? I can see you through the window. I knew it. Oh god, oh god. Ah, what button am I hit? Q, okay. That's twice, dude. Oh shit, she was close. Give me that, babe. Oh, die, zombie bitch. Okay, I went a little overboard there. A little panic. Man. Hi there. Did you kill it? I don't know. I think so. Sometimes they come back. Have you killed one? No, but they get shot a lot. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah, I want my parents to come home now. I think that might be a little while, you know? Oh. Look. I don't know what happened, but I'll look after you until then. What should we do now? We need to find help before it gets dark. Yeah, it's not safe at night. Oh, hell yeah, safety at daylight. <clears throat> Let's go. Stay close to me. That is how I would die, because I'd pick up every little kid straggler that I found, or old person. Yeah. Yeah, that's pretty much how my death would occur. Come on, sweetie. Let's go. <laughs> Let me hobble on over. You know people are going to think I'm a zombie now. Oh, is there a shed? Can I go to the shed? 
Okay, controls. Let's see. What am I doing here? How do I get around things? Oh, I, I see it's not going to let me go around things. Oh, man. I ain't never getting home to Mama at this rate. This sucks. Well, it's hot dish night. Hot dish night. I had a friend Amy explain what hot dish night hot dishes were. Definitely not a Pacific Northwest What's thing. The matter? Should I stay? What? I don't want to sleep in the treehouse tonight, but I don't know if I should leave. What if my parents come home? Are you coming with me, babe? I won't leave you alone. Coming well, with let's me. Go somewhere safe that's close, okay? That's a good idea. Oh, guys, do you have a car? Come on. Hey, man! Holy shit! Don't eat us! Holy shit! We're not gonna hurt you. Yeah. Thought for a second you and the little one were both gonna give us the chomp. What are you doing? Trying to get home. This neighborhood's a disaster. Are you trying to get out of here? Because you should be. Those things are all over the damn place. I haven't seen anything as gnarly as this neighborhood since downtown Atlanta, 15 miles back. I'm Sean. Sean Green. Lee, this is Clementine. I'm Chet. We shouldn't be out in the open like this. How about you help us clear the way, and we'll take you and your daughter out of here and down to my family's farm. It should be safer there. I'm not a dad. I'm... <laughs> I'm just some guy. some guy. Some guy? Yeah. She's alone? Let's get going. Staying put for too long is a mistake. What do you want to do? I... The monster's coming. We gotta go. Leave. Okay, we're out of here. Let's go. Kind of seems like a horrible choose your own adventure. For just some guy, it seems like you saved a bunch of lives today. Yep, it does seem like a horrible choose your own adventure. Horrible is in horror movie, not horrible is in bad. 